One always wondered what would have caused the collision between the two ships in broad daylight. This eventually led to the oil spill along the coastline and this also meant suspension of vessel traffic to Mumbai and the JN ports last week. Human error, negligence on the part of the captain and failure of communication facilities are being investigated. A look at the ship traffic management system at Mumbai port and the circumstances in which the collision took place may help understand the outcome of the investigations better. How did it happen? According to reports, a collision took place around 10 a.m. on August 7 in the common channel for both Mumbai and JN port. The container ship MSC Chitra, which was coming out of the JN port, was hit by the brake bow carrier MV Collegia 3 as it was proceeding to berth at the Mumbai port. Following the collision, the MSC Chitra tilted and over 300 loaded containers fell from the ship into the water, blocking vessel traffic through the main channel. The ship slowly moved and was grounded outside the channel. The other vessel, its bows severely damaged, was safe berthed in the Mumbai port. Salvage experts were immediately summoned and many of the containers have been retrieved. Traffic partially resumed from Friday with the help of the Navy. Woodside Petroleum Limited is seeking reserves to underpin an expansion of the 13 billion Australian dollar Pluto project in Australia, made a gas discovery at a prospect off the northwest coast. Australia's second largest oil and gas producer said that the Alaric well intersected at about 185 meters, as close to 600 feet of gas, according to a statement today at the stock exchange. Woodside rose 2.3% to 42.48 Australian dollars in Sydney at 11.37 am, compared with a drop of 0.9% in the benchmark. President Barack Obama and his family encouraged tourists to visit the Gulf Coast region with a weekend trip to Florida that included a purple sighting and a swim in coastal waters as the administration tried to boost the area's economy in the aftermath of the BP PLC oil spill. As BP moves closer to completing a relief well to permanently kill the damaged Macondo well, which had gushed estimated 4.9 million barrels of oil into the Gulf of Mexico, it was sealed last month. The Obama administration is shifting to the next phase of its response to the disaster, cleaning up the remaining oil, restoring parts of the coastline and bolstering an economy that relies largely on tourism. Well, that is all the news as of now. Do come back later for some more.